Friends, I'm Reverend Carrie Parker, and I bring you greetings from the Wisconsin Council of Churches as its executive director. We pray that as the natural world awakens around us and we begin to emerge from our COVID hibernation, that the spirit is breaking through with hopeful experiences. This is our second year in the midst of a global pandemic. In our first COVID-19 Eastertide, most of us had no idea what it meant to live through a pandemic. The local churches and other faith communities we supported were all asking, how do we do church if we can't gather in person? Pastors and other spiritual caregivers were adrift. Those one-to-one -one moments that are so essential to community life became fearful to engage in. It seemed every pastor had an avalanche of questions and needed to learn new skills every week. At the Wisconsin Council of Churches, we too were learning to shift from in-person modes to something new. We once thought we specialized in big events. What the pandemic brought into clear focus was that relationships are our main strength. A deep and broad network of congregations and their leaders made us a central place for faith communities in the state to get clear information about COVID topics. We leveraged our connections to bring people together digitally for webinars with experts, and we provided a much needed space for clergy to support one another. In this year where we had to give up so much of what we knew about how to carry out ministry, those digital gathering times grew our network. We made so many new friends in those webinars, new relationships for a new reality. So many more people are aware of the council and its work than ever before. While our core ministry remains right here in Wisconsin, we've been able to reach people all across the United States, providing assistance when it was needed most. We're amazed at the fruit of the relationships nurtured during these 18 months. Our robust network has been noticed. We were awarded a large multi-year grant to intentionally strengthen connections between churches, to strengthen churches, and to help them strengthen their communities. Our staff is growing. We're able to launch a rapid response to civic crisis so faith leaders have support to address emerging issues. We now have a significant grant to assist with COVID vaccine outreach and education through faith communities in the state to reach folks who have the most questions about the vaccine and the most challenges with access. We hope that whether you're someone who found us during the pandemic through our COVID resources, or you're a longtime friend of the council, you'll consider making a financial gift to this ministry. With your help, the Wisconsin Council of Churches is creating resources that help the church move forward with courage, justice, and holy imagination. Grace and peace to you in your ministry and in your hopes for the future. <laughs>